I'm Dino Pase, Managing Director of FARAM. Uh, FARAM is uh, an organization, an Italian organization dedicated to fitting out um, office space uh, in London and internationally. VTB for us was a uh, client which we had come into, co into contact six months earlier in, uh, in Moscow. Uh, we happened to be awarded a big skyscraper headquarter fit out in Moscow. So um, as a result of that, we were introduced to a project in London. Uh, the project in London we were able to tackle at a much earlier stage. So our input was to uh, try and uh, look at the complete design and trying to provide an answer for every single package. Um, in this project, uh, what gave us the competitive edge was the fact that we put forward uh, three integrated packages. The uh, most important one at the end of the day that won us the project was the dealing desk um, solution because we're trying to integrate it with our uh, current and normal um, desk offer, but also integrate all the dealing desk um, requirements in terms of uh, having a lot of monitors. Uh, this was used by the client in terms of having a single or double row. The um, accessories that we used to work with the desk were already integral to the desk because we had already developed prior a solution of a bracket that connected the CBS uh, stand with our, with our under frame. So we were able to replicate this one quite quickly. Uh, also the client, by the time they, we were on board, they wanted to have a final solution very quickly. So we had to work with the CBS very quickly to put one, two, three mockups in place, one after the other, to reach the final stage for approval, and then from there to sign off the project. Uh, there is um, a very good synergy between the, the two companies, Farm and CBS. Um, we work on finishes. Our finishes are very important. Uh, looking at a piece of furniture, the finishes could be compatible. But also the design has got to be very, very similar. So we have developed in the past a uh, connection between our underframe and the standard monitor arm. So we are able to choose most of the arm selections and make them fit to our desk. So we can supply a, a client different levels of price with the same uh, range of products, so to speak. Uh, the main objectives of this project was to build a Russian champion investment bank. Uh, to that end, it was important for us to provide the tools and the workplace environment for our employees. Well, I think the key thing that, that Farham and CBS both added was the um, adaptability um, and flexibility. Um, the, you know, one of the essential things we had was that we wanted to use a system design furniture. Uh, we didn't want to buy specialist uh, furniture specifically for our trading floor. So part of their flexibility was around uh, sitting with us and working on a redesign uh, for our trading floor. The advantage to that was that we then had a standardised uh, product that we could fit throughout our, our, our floor space. That meant that, that you know, as if we reshape our floors in any way, we don't have to change furniture, we can use the same design furniture throughout. We looked at um, then how the the trader specifically normally sits at his desk and uh, we wanted freer airflow um, between the desk, reduced heat, it meant we could introduce new technologies around blades. Um, so environmentally friendly it works um, um, much better for us as well. Uh, so, so, that, so that adaptability and in design and the flexibility of that design um, allowed us to, to achieve that. Um, on the CBS side, obviously, it's a, it's a, it's a robust, um, ergonomically designed product that, that means that we can um, adjust it to what our requirements are. We put, we put it on every desk. Um, to the extent on the trading floor, there's multiple arms on, on each desk to support up to um, eight, eight screens uh, where the trader requires it. You know, scalability, modularity is um, exactly what we were looking for. I, I trained as an architect but haven't practiced for some time, however I've maintained my interest in architecture so I actually quite like, enjoy, I enjoy working with um, in the industry and working with the furniture companies because it means I get to see what's being built. I mean the VTB building is particularly interesting, it's an old listed building and it's been gutted, some of the key parts have been retained such as the lift with all the old push push buttons and, and what have you, all the windows have been retained but they've got this fantastic glass structure on the roof and the, the architects have um, done a cracking job. There's lots of modern, innovative parts, um, and, but they've retained a lot of older parts and they, and they actually work very well together. So for me, it's quite exciting to be able to work with on projects like that. <laughs>